Hello, in this video I am going to explain you about a laminar flow cabinet. Now, laminar flow cabinet is a working desk of an embryologist. So, we perform most of our procedures under this cabinet, whether it is a screening of eggs or uh, insemination of uh, eggs, uh, freezing of sperms, freezing of eggs, freezing of embryos, uh, preparation of culture dishes. So, everything is done under, under this cabinet. Now, laminar flow uh, has three things apart from the working cabinet. Uh, the first thing is the HEPA filter, the second is the fan or the motor and the third is the filter pad. The fan sucks the atmospheric air uh, through the filter pad at the top and then pre-filtered air is passed through the HEPA filter where contaminating bacteria and fungi are removed and sterile air is blown into the working surface. So we get sterile conditions inside to perform our procedures. We can actually adjust the pressure of the air which is blown uh, in the working uh, surface. Uh, now the ideal uh, pressure is between 5 and 15 psi. We usually set it to 10 psi as the ideal uh, pressure. Now laminar flow cabinet is made of uh, uh, is, is made of metal and the surface as you can see is made of stainless steel. So we can easily clean the surface with the help of uh, disinfectant. Uh, the cabinet also has uh, ultraviolet light. Uh, to sterilize uh, the surface and the objects which are kept inside. So we usually clean the surface uh, with the help of disinfectant and then we switch on the ultraviolet light for about 15 minutes uh, uh, before we start the procedures in the morning. Now there are two types of uh, laminar flow cabinets. Uh, one is a vertical laminar flow and the other is a horizontal uh, laminar flow cabinet. Now this one is a vertical laminar flow cabinet. Uh, now in a vertical laminar flow cabinet, the HEPA filter, the fan uh, is on the top of the working cabinet whereas in the horizontal uh, laminar flow cabinet, the fan and the HEPA filter is at the back of the cabinet. Okay, thank you for watching.